Hello, hello everybody and welcome back. I hope you all have had a great week so far and are looking forward to the weekend. And if not, I hope you get that your your uh your days get better, frankly. Um but anyway, today we'll be getting back into Gotham Knights, as you can see right down here in this little corner. Um, but before we do that, just a quick reminder that I have a Patreon that you can reach at either of these two links, either directly at patreon.com slash Crimson Knight or at linktree slash Crimson Knight, um, where, uh, actually I should leave those up, <coughs> where you can support me and help continue to ensure that I can make content like this and etc. 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 Anyway, um, it has. It feels like it's been a fucking while. We seem to have you back, Batgirl. Are you all right? I'm fine. The court is mining some strange substance, and it looks a hell of a lot like. Belfry, you're cutting out. Belfry. You take forever to do the simplest of tasks. We have things to discuss. Come find me. That. That. That that was basically what I was going to say. Um, oh, I love the detail on her costume. Anyway, uh, we were... We could go here and do that. Um, we also have... What does he want again? Actually, hold on. I have a better idea. All right, we've got... Harley Quinn to do. Return to the Belfry. Okay. Uh, return to the Belfry. Return to the Belfry. Uh, go to the dollhouse. Which is in the Belfry. Uh, visit Batman Memorial. Uh, interrogate criminals. Stop witnesses under, uh, Witnesses under attack crimes. Penguin. Visit Lucius Fox. Okay, so he's gonna give me another set of XP and stuff. Uh, defeat Feral Talons. Crafting. Okay. Um, well then in that case... You wanna go say hi to him? No, we're right here. Let's go do this first. At the top of the GCNB. Court of Owls is watching. From inside of Gotham's walls, they lurk in every shadow. And they rule you, one and all. You used us. You knew about the court and waited for <coughs> us to do the dirty work for you. Yes. Sounds about that sounds about right for when Talia. Still part of the league. We observed the court's growth in Gotham. Now you can see the city's rotten core. They call what they're mining Dionysium. But it looks like it's from a Lazarus pit. A foul substitute for the true miracle. A contaminated extract. For centuries, the court has been looking for a fountain of youth. Instead, they found the makings of undying monsters. So those talents, that's what they're using to create them. So why not make a trade? A Lazarus pit for their science. You'd have a loyal army without ever recruiting another ninja. <laughs> <laughs> Even in their current debased state, the League would never descend to such banality. And the no, they wouldn't. Greed and corruption prevent them from ever mastering the secrets of the Lazarus pits. Of course, you get to use the Lazarus pits because you're so generous and kind. Oh, those are some harsh words. I gave you back your friend, Jason. I kind of wish I'd brought Jason to this conversation now. Oh, I need to look that up on YouTube. Hold up. Let me open a browser so I can find it. 
Uh Okay. All right, we'll 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 let the scene progress and then we'll watch and then we'll and then I'll pull that up and we can watch that. I'm curious how that went it. down. And I know you didn't do it as some kind of favor to me or Bruce. I suppose gratitude was too much to expect in exchange for another stab at life. He didn't ask for your help, Talia. None of us did. Was Bruce gone, the court's operation grows. The League of Shadows will raise Gotham to the ground unless you silence the court. Just spit it out, Talia. You want the voice gone, and you want to use us to do it for you. But what do you get out of it? I'll do what I can to distract the League. And your path to the Court of Owls will be clear. God, she's badass. Oof. Oh, now I get how Montoya feels. Nice. All right. Uh, let me quickly futz with OBS real quick. I believe I have a. Oh, I do not. I thought I did. OK, bear with me. Bear with me one second. I have to do some fiddly shit. Hopefully this won't affect things too much. We want a browser source. No. We want window capture. That's what we want. Okay. Uh, that works. Resize you just a little bit. Drag this back over here. Yes, how does that affect it? Okay. All right. This source is there. Okay. Um, actually. Let's shrink that down a bit. There we go. That's what we'll do. All right. <clears throat> All right. So we're going to check this out real quick. This is where Jason meets with Talia. Just, just what we saw, but with Jason instead of uh, Barbara. This was posted by uh, OG Big Nut on uh, YouTube a year ago. You have subtitles, not just English generated. Okay. So why doesn't the League make a deal? Trade the court some green goo in exchange for mindless talon ninjas. <laughs> Even in their current debased state, the League would never descend to such banality. And the court's greed and corruption prevent them from ever mastering the secrets of the Lazarus pits. You turned a chemical reaction into some kind of bullshit holy ritual. Oh, those are some harsh words. That ceremony resurrected you, Jason. I knew it was you, Talia. That pit scrambled my mind, but I'm still a damn good detective. I suppose gratitude was too much to expect in exchange for another stab at life. After all the shit you've done to me, I don't owe you anything. Oh. Oh, that was good. Okay. All right, that was good. That was some good shit. All right. All right, back to the game. Sorry. I just, I needed to know, and I didn't, 
I don't know of a way to uh, bring that back around with him, you know? Um, okay. Trying to remember. Okay, I do want to go talk to him. Before I go back, what, do, what else do we have? I do want to do some basic patrolling. Just because it's been a minute. I want to get my eye back in. Does she ever? No, she doesn't have her ability yet. Oop, wrong button. You know what I just realized? You know what I just realized? I don't know if the audio from that browser actually came through. Hold up. <laughs> I'm gonna feel really bad if I just made you guys watch that with no actual audio. Um, let me... Yeah, I'm looking for history, that's what I want. Um... Why doesn't the League make a deal? Okay, yeah, it, comes, it came through. Good, 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 good. Man can't even get comfortable on his own roof with you around. All right. Now. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to fast travel to here. <clears throat> and we're going to drive around the city. And just kind of patrol and see what's up, you know? On YouTube instead of YouTube. On YouTube, that makes me fucking laugh. within range. Oop, wrong button.
vigilante. They won't last. This was a waste of time. Ah, there's something. Go. That asshole better be here soon. Damn it! Back over here. What's the grab button? Fuck me! What's the goddamn grab button? Tab. I was doing that. Eh, whatever. Where am I? I am I'm in the Bowery. Okay. So I drove through there. There wasn't really anything. Let's drive over to the West End, which is west, I assume. Yes. Shit, sorry sir. That's another one for the uh, Wayne Medical Fund. <laughs> Wayne Found the Medical Foundation. What are you guys fucking doing? Yeah, y'all fucking look like you were setting something on fire. So, you know. <gasps> Sorry, my nose is really itching. Okay. Rotten cheese. Mm 
You're fine. Walk it off. I just rammed into a car <laughs> or a wall or something. Did you get? <laughs> Oh wait, nope, not that one. <laughs> Sorry, I can feel the tickle in the back of my throat. <coughs> Shit, where'd you come from? <laughs> Montoya, I thought you'd be off fighting crime somewhere. Like that make a difference. The department's a joke now. There are more cops on the take than ever. Criminals keep getting out on appeal. At least when Jim was around, we could count on you guys to help. Now you're the enemy. Feels like we're fighting a war on every front. No matter what Kane says about us, we'll always be here to help. You won't get rid of us that easily. I don't know if I should be sad or relieved. Maybe a bit of both. As much as I hate to say it, it's... It's good to have you guys here. 
Because we'll need more than a few honest cops to save this city. Hey, you saved someone's life out there. Interrogate more criminals, stop premeditated crimes. Okay. Heading to Tri Corner Island real quick. Because there were at least two more crimes. Lovely crimes for us to deal with there. Of course you won't. All right. Go check on this cop. Make sure he's good. Make sure he's okay. Maybe you vigilantes aren't all bad. We ain't. Just remember that we're on the same side. Now, there was one more. Let's see if I can find it. It showed up when I was on my way close to over here. There it is. Ah, it's at the docks. All right. Where'd the cop go? Did he? Did he get the safety? Looks like he got the safety. All right. <laughs> Same, bro.
Onwards to old Gotham. You're fine. Sorry. Excuse me. I apologize for all the coughing. Ah, there's one. Get fucked. All right, let's hear it. All right, here's what I know. Just what I wanted to hear. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Alrighty. One more. All right.
Okay. Pops. Crimes. Lovely crimes. <laughs> Oh, just you, huh? That's way too high. Get out of the corner. All right. Come on, spill. I'll tell you everything. Thanks for the info. There we go. All right. Okay, day. One over there. All right, we'll go there first. Oakley, Oakley. Do do do. 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 You know what I just realized? When I was at the uh, docks taking care of the the fuckers there. I forgot to actually collect my uh, loot. Oh well. This one might hurt. You, please, stop it. Let's go. Get a block. Let's talk. Just what I wanted to hear. All righty. Next. Oh, 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 oh. Speaking of forgetting to forgetting my loot. All right. Got a jet. <laughs> All right. Was there any other crates or anything? No. Okay. Up there, you go. You want my future? Then stop. Oh, damn it, mouse.
cow fucking mouse. Appreciate it. Okay, there's another one right there. All right, let's see what I got here. Oh, over there. There we go. Well, it ain't Batman. Well, you don't know. You know, Batgirl would be great if you were going the right direction. Where is it? Where is it? Right here. All right.
Let me go check on the cop. Stay away, vigilante. I called for backup. You better head off before they show up. Thank you for the warning. It's gas. All right. Um. I'm all the way back up here. Let's quickly check, make sure nobody's wanting to talk to me. No. What's this? What's in here? All right. All right. Uh, where am? Where am? There am. I hope you have one of these. Eight crimes stopped, uh, eight cops rescued, 16 citizens rescued. Okay. Hey, Alfred, did the city records turn up anything? They didn't. According to the city permits, there's been no mining in Gotham City since the cauldron was completed. Judging from what we found last night, they've been digging down there for centuries. So listen, Alfred. Babs managed to repair some of the court voice recordings. Dionysium <clears throat> brought the Talons back to life. Sort of. Dionysium's basically weak as hell Lazarus pit water. Brings back motor functions, but free will's as good as gone. So what is a Talon exactly? Some kind of feral zombie assassin? We've all seen weirder shit. Yeah. Maybe. Feral zombie. Sounds like Jason, all right. I recognize a voice. The older woman is Constance Cobblepot. I'm fairly certain. Of course it is. And the others? More difficult to say. Maybe if I heard them in person. Not gonna happen. In person? Tim, put the waveforms on the screen. It's hard to find a match with all the damage and voice modulation. Maybe the matching system would have better luck if... We match what we have against the live voices. Fun, but how do we find these jackasses? Two words. Orchard Hotel. The Masquerade. The event of the season. This year's dedicated to Master Bruce. Gotham's rich dress up and pretend they're humanitarians. I've been a few times. So it's dirt. Of course you have. Yeah, basically. So many of Gotham's elite together. Security at the masquerade will be tight. Finding out their plans first would give you an important advantage. I'll tweak our masks to record telescopic audio. If we can get a good vantage point, we may be able to put some faces to these mystery voices. Sounds like our kind of party. Bruce Thomas Wayne. Aww. We got new intel for the evidence board. <coughs> I leveraged a mutual acquaintance. The head of security for the Orchard Hotel, Mr. Hendricks, has agreed to a meeting. The details are pinned to the evidence board.
crime scene? Cool. But what about your photographic memory? Cold case. When I wasn't there, it helps to see it laid out. The detail is incredible. Commissioner Gordon? Detective Gordon, at the time. You made it look just like his statue. Now that we know about the court, I thought I might be able to close a few of his unsolved cases. Solid thinking. Oh, I'll help. <clears throat> you didn't ask for help, Tim. I'm good. I'll let you know if I find anything. It's fine. Two heads are better than one. I'm sorry. I'd like to do this myself. Sure. Let me know if you need anything. It's nothing personal, Tim. It's personal for her. You know, like this is a thing she needs to do. Nothing against you, Tim. Oh. Ooh, a bike time trial. Interesting. I've always heard the Orchard Hotel is haunted. That's true at least one night a year. A bunch of rich ghouls in uh. masks. Ha ha ha. Wow, that's a nice fucking boot they're making. Jesus Christ, look at that. Okay, now that it's done, what are you going to do with it? Are you just going to pretend it's not there and wait for me to turn the camera away? Yep. <laughs> Alright, let's have her start her gliding. Hold space while airborne to glide while using glide hold control for nosedive. All right, now. Not that button. That button. There we go. Abilities. All right. Oh shoot. I have one ability point I can play in and that I can play. Okay. Um Oh, wow. I like all three of those. <laughs> okay. All right, let's us equip all suit mods. All right. Hmm. 
I wonder if they're if they're in a beyond suit if if she's in a beyond suit if her gliding thing like if the wings will come out like uh like it does in the Batman Beyond series that would be pretty fucking cool if it did Metal Oop, wrong button. This is the button I wanted. Alright, so we want to unequip that. I don't have any ranged mods on. Okay. So um Um, the way it gives her little bat ears like they're fucking cat ears on a <laughs> oh man <sighs> okay I'm thinking One two one two ninety two thirty. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's dismantle that. Dismantle that. Dismantle that. Dismantle that. Okay. Now. Uh. Melee. That one does higher damage. I think with mods I can make that damage increase. What I got? No. Okay. Uh, we'll do that one, and then oh, I can't mod it. Okay, yeah, no, we'll we'll stick to the owl buster. At least until craft something more. Alright. Not that one. Yeah, not that one. This one. Crafting suits, bioelectric suits. Look at her hair in that one. Holy shit. All right. Oh, damn it. I keep doing that. All right. Do I have anything that I can craft that would be better? Um, doesn't look like it. All right. Ranged. Ah, now that one. That one is worth it. All right. So this one I can put a mod on. This one I can put a mod on, and this I can put this uh, on the suit I can put a mod on. Um. Now styles. No. 
This is, me this is metal suit, right? Yeah. Alright, cowl. No. No. <laughs> the fucking cat ears kill me. Uh, does it show her hair at all? It doesn't look like it. Oh, damn it. I don't mean no. No, it doesn't. Okay. Styles, that's what I want. Very minor changes. Uh, yeah, okay. So what we'll do is, let's see, Raider. No. Nightwatch is the one we normally, that we've been using. Um, we do Night Ops now. Beyond. Eh. I want, eventually I do want to tr test that. I don't want to do it on stream, but I want to test the gliding to see if, you know. Um, metal. Privateer. Demon. Neon Noir. Tier 1. Tunnel. Titan. Titan is tempting. The new guard is the one from the actual, from the actual game. But, um, Titan is tight and tempting. Uh, which one has the longest cape? The Night Watch? The Night Watch. Okay. Versus Titan. I really want the Knighthood one, which looks like a color swap alteration to the Titan one, but the Knighthood is the one I want. I can't get that one yet. I think we're going to stick with Nightwatch. Um, keep doing that. I don't mean to. All right. Uh, yeah. All right. Now let's add. Well, actually, she's not going out yet, so let's not. She's not going to be going out next. Let's not add mods to her uh just yet Clark family has sworn its allegiance to the court for generations. <clears throat> and I, for my part, have been steadfast in my oath. I have always wanted what's best for Gotham, for us. But the time has come when I must stand alone in protecting the court from itself. We have been changing. Perhaps I've taken too long to notice. The council once strategically minded and le uh, once st strategically minded and level handed has become increasingly brutal in their methods. Where the council of my day engaged in chess to reach their ends, today's members are quick to violence and should sooner topple the board in a childlike and would sooner chopper, topple the board in a childlike fit. I take no issue with violence as a method of problem solving, but with a, con a considered hand, not as the default. I fear the current council is turning us into, no into nothing more than a common mob. It's embarrassing. Talons may serve as instruments of the will of the court, but our most valuable weapon is secrecy. It used to be that the court preferred to operate in the shadows because benevolence did not demand a, sp a spotlight. However, now the shadows are no longer granting anonymity to mach machinations, 
benefiting our great city, but of selfish corruption. Perhaps it has always been this way, and what has changed is, is the clarity with which I see us. Regardless, the only solution is to cast a cleansing light upon, upon them in hopes that we can come together and root out the corruption and begin anew. Erastus Clark. Handwritten on the back of the page, I have taken on this project in secret in hopes of a grand presentation to the council and voice. However, my research does not re does require the cooperation of others. I have recently begun asking questions of some of our longer standing members, those who have lived our history, uh, those who have lived our history. I confided in one of them that I had begun writing this book, and I fear I have chosen my confidants poorly. I can feel eyes on me when I walk into the room now, as if my presence demands it, it, it demands attention. Not a spotlight. No surveillance. It could be merely coincidence. But twice recently, upon t walking through a room, have the hushed tones of gossip risen in my wake. My pursuit is a noble one. When my work is finally revealed, I will regain their respect and... Uh, and they will line up outside my door for an audience. To those who find this, I write this note in haste, hoping whoever reads this, reads it is more capable of acting upon the book's contents than I. You will question the words within, but I assure you every bit of it is true. The Court of Owls is no legend, but rather they are the true parents of Gotham City. My grandfather was among their ra their ranks, and, des and despite having never met the man, I hate him. By his deeds do my family still suffer never spending more than a year or two in one place under an assumed name I dare not give. Every shadow, every trick of the light fraught with potential danger. I asked my grandmother once why we live in such fear when the architect of this feud is surely long dead. She would only answer that the court does not forgive, nor does it forget. The court ordered everyone who has read this accursed text dead at the hand of the Talons. The publisher was killed, and my grandfather's body was never found. This, his handwritten copy, and his notes were hidden. Or, I should imagine, they would have, been, would have shared in whatever fate he succumbed to. My grandfather wanted to use this book to destroy the court, but I confess I am a coward. Merely standing on Gotham City soil lights my every nerve on fire. So the idea of declaring war on the court is beyond my capacity. I am scattering the pages and hope, and hope against hope that you, dear reader, are somehow better equipped to make use of them than I. The court has ruined the lives of, of my entire family, and who knows how many countless more besides. Should you be foolish enough to take on this task, I can only wish you luck. If you do not, and the court is allowed to continue unopposed, then God help us all. Clear an owl's nest. To craft a rare suit. And um, what was Lucius wanting? Melee weapon and suit. Okay. So I have to craft a rare suit. So let's do that real quick. I have a rare suit right here. Right. I'm not going to equip it. Uh, I did. Ability acquired drone. Um, not only is the court real, but so are talons. I thought they'd be more, I don't know. They're supposed to be the court's greatest weapon. It's more difficult to control someone capable of free will. Or anyone able to think at all. But that doesn't mean we can underestimate them. They are still capable fighters. Sure. I just won't try to have a conversation with them. It says craft a rare suit. I did. Is it a different rare suit?
So I did get the thing, okay. But first, we need to actually swap it back to that. There we go. So I don't have a privateer style suit. Uh... Court must have been mining this Dionysium for decades, maybe more. And yet they didn't hesitate to blow it all up just to get us. Sucks we couldn't get more info while we were down there. But you're all alive. That's what matters. Right. They won't be getting rid of us that easily. <laughs> oh. Emails. Moreno case. To all from Barbara Gordon. Hey everyone, I followed up on the Moreno case mentioned in the messages we found at the Gazette. Looks like we were right on the money. Judge Elena Moreno abruptly took a leave of absence from the bench after her brother Alex was found dead a few weeks ago for family reasons, according to her official statement. Um, but her last case before the announcement, denying a petition to shut down construction at the Chelsea Tunnel, and she hasn't been seen in public since. This reeks of owl. Let's keep an eye on it. To Barbara from Dick, urgent for real this time. Sorry about last time, I couldn't help myself. This time for real, though. The court can only continue to operate in the shadows, and they've done a great job of covering their tracks, but I think I've figured out a, a surefire way to take them down once and for all. We just start telling everyone the truth about them. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love him so much. <clears throat> to Tim from Barbara, efficiencies. When you have some time, I'd love to brainstorm possible efficiencies for the Belfry. When the cave was destroyed, we lost a lot. Thankfully, we didn't lose any of Bruce's files, but that's only because of his forward thinking. The Belfry is not set up with the same level of redundancy as the Bat Cave was. And if anything happened here, we'd be, well, it wouldn't be good. This gave me the idea of, ut of utilizing encrypted satellites as redundancy servers to store our files and data. That way, no matter what happens to the Belfry or to any of us, the data would be safe and accessible from anywhere. I know you'll probably tell me I'm being overcautious, but if ever there was a time to be, it's now. Just something I'm thinking about. To Dick from Barbara, your temp password again. Here's your new temp password for the 50th time. Consider perhaps maybe writing it down somewhere or, I don't know, remembering it like a normal person. Just a thought. Temp password. Babs is so cool, so great, so awesome, and smart 13. Reminder, will expire. Must reset within 24 hours. I mean it. <laughs> <clears throat> to all from Barbara. I've been meaning to run some tests on the, bat, on the bat cycle recently, so I talked to Dinah, and she had a great idea. What better way to test the bat cycle's speed and maneuverability than with some races? She can even set, uh, she can even set some courses that, that, oh my god. That'll really put the bike through its paces. And I don't know about you guys, but I could use something fun to do for a change. That sounds awesome. All right. Okay, day. Yum. I don't understand. Clayface fell in a turbine when he last fought Batman. How is he still alive? I'm not sure. He was torn to shreds. And yet, here we are. Just getting blended like a smoothie wasn't enough for him. So, what did we learn about our new friend? Well, I've studied Clayface's DNA before, and this is unlike anything I've ever seen. The structure's constantly changing. It's, it's like it can't reassemble itself. We're talking damaged nucleotides, unstable phosphate groupings, and synthesis abnormalities. I mean, abnormal even for Clayface. This sample seems especially disorganized, like, like it's trying to be five things at once. Oh, maybe it's because these pieces of him on their own aren't enough for him to stabilize into a singular conscious entity. <clears throat> you guys are doing your nerd thing again. Sorry. 
Clayface might be in too many places at once, and he's having trouble being anything because of it. But the more that Clayface comes together, the stronger and smarter he gets. We definitely do not want that. But what if he's already conscious? I mean, we can't just leave him like this. Putting him back together could endanger the whole city. We can't take that chance. Either way, it doesn't do us any good if we don't know where he is. The reservoir is connected to the city's aqueduct system. He could be anywhere. I love that she's got a bat necklace. There are probably still bits of him in the water, too. It's nice knowing you, Jason. <laughs> He'll be fine. Probably. I'll scan the city for the Clay's unique signature. I'll let you all know if I find something. Yeah, have fun with that. I'm gonna go throw up, he says. <laughs> Big old boy. Ooh. There you go. All right, momentum ability challenge. Styles to wait, wait. Yeah, well, uh, not knighthood. Go crafting. How are we doing on Lucius's thing? Crap. Uh, I have to crap. A melee weapon of any variety. I'll just squeeze. Um, <clears throat> okay, he's got five things. Uh, Use the tablet upstairs. Hell yeah, we'll do that in a second. Um, first, uh, gear though. I was going to craft. Do this. Look. All right. So that should have. All right. Here. All right. All right, email first. All right. 
to Dick from Sonia Branch. Dick, I wanted to extend my condolences. I know how much Bruce means to you. When you're ready, I'd like to set up a time for us to have a lunch and talk about some possible opportunities. I've heard through the grapevine that you are acting as Wayne's designate on the board of directors. Gotham Municipal Bank has been trying to get the ear of Wayne Enterprises for years, but the board has been loyal to Gotham National Bank since the dawn of time. We have some compelling offers on the table if you're willing to listen. No rush, but let me know. Uh, Gotham Insurance Network. With the threat of supervillainy, vigilante may mishaps, and other worldly disasters added on top of an already stressful list of potential hazards like theft, flooding, and fire, getting insurance in Gotham can be a hassle, but it doesn't have to be. Gotham Insurance Network is a collective of insurance agencies of various size and focus, all committed to getting you the insurance you need at a cost you can afford. Use our worst case scenario calculator to build a potential scenario and see how it would impact your premiums. Gotham Insurance Network approved agencies guarantee competitive rates, helpful customer service, and most importantly, peace of mind. <laughs> Ooh, Lois Lane. Oh, hey, Dick. I don't know if you'd call this flattering or foolish, but I've heard through the rumor mill that someone is taken up as Bloodhaven's new guardian. Calls himself Nightwing, if you can believe it. Working on figuring out what his deal is, but I thought I'd check in to see if this rings a bell at all, or if you'd have any clue who might be delusional enough to think this is a good idea. If anything smells off, Clark is local and can handle it. I'll keep you posted. Oh! Nightwing, N-I-T-E. Ha 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 ha. I wonder if it's Batmite. <laughs> all right. Uh, all right. All right. Let's go up and talk and interact with that uh, thing up upstairs. Up there's. It's the same conversation that Alfred and Tim had and Jason and Tim had. So, what do you think? This place is quite remarkable. It's certainly brighter than the Batcave. <laughs> I wish Bruce could see this. It's not the manor, but I think he'd like it. Yeah. I know he would. Because this is your home. No matter how hard we try, there's always more to do. But Bruce never gave up, and neither will we. Protecting Gotham is a difficult endeavor, one that Bruce knew you would face. So, he made sure that you would have everything you'd need to succeed. Of course he did. Alright, give me one second, because I want to see if I've unlocked anything new for him. this. Probably not. I like that gold one, though. The Black Adam one. Spoiler! Oh, great ghost! Cosmic, Pastel, Tractor, Azure, Crimson. That's the one! I like that the signatures, the signature ones are all identical, except for the piping and the accent colors. That's great.
Yeah, I'm when I get when I get the crimson one, that's the one I'm using. That one right there. I wish it would tell me how to get it. All right, fine. Um, anyway. Anyway. Let me quickly check with the punching dummy here. Or this thing. Make quickly make sure that I didn't. I'm not missing anything. <coughs> I didn't think so, but. All right. All right, on to Tim. Hey, buddy. Your turn. Good old Tim. All right. Anything new for me to interact with? No? Okay. All right. So, first things first, abilities. We have three. Uh, particle accelerator in the ro microbot's core engine. You can call five instead of three. Maybe. Uh... Uh, this one for sure um and you know what sure i'll go ahead and do that one too uh challenges He still needs to defeat the some freaks bulldozers. Um, here. Shit. I keep doing that. Alright, suit. What do we got? Uh, yeah, sure. I'll go ahead and craft that. And swap it to Nightwatch. And what's the metal one look like? That's the button I'm looking for. I mean, I like that that's a bit red, uh, uh, red robin, but nah. Symbol. I think that's the one I would like. Uh, that one. All right. The iconic Charlie, I think, is the le is would be the one that I would like. <sighs> but it's not a black back. Damn. Mm. Like I like that for the majority of the suit, but the back of the cape is no, 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 no. It would need to be that. If I was going to do this, if I was going to do this, it would need to be that, but no, um, we're going to, what am I looking for? Night watch. There we go. All right. Crafting. I don't have a better one of those. Nothing being arranged. All right. There we go. All right. <clears throat> to Jason from Tim, I've been thinking about how to expand our mobility as a team and was hoping 
we could bounce some ideas around don't get me wrong the bat cycle is great but we lost a lot of stuff when we lost the cave we might not be able to salvage any of the actual vehicles but we could use them for inspiration maybe once we get some stuff together we could take it to lucius anyway give it some thought oh man imagine if they each had their own vehicle to tim from jason with Talia around again, I've been thinking a lot about just my life in general. Twice I was found and taken in by somebody in a time of need. Once as a little punk on the streets by Bruce, the other Talia. Bruce saw potential in me and worked worked to help me see it in myself. Talia saw a weapon and turned me into one. I know I'm the product of the people around me, and I think that's true for a lot of people. The wrong influence at the wrong time can put you in a bad path. So I had the idea of, pro of a program for disadvantaged youths. Something to keep vulnerable kids from finding the wrong role model. Keep them away from the gangs. Show them a better path. I want to have a bunch of mentors from different fields and professions. Would be willing to do kind of take your kid to work days, uh, information sessions, stuff like that. Maybe those could turn into internships or shadowing opportunities when the fit is right. I want to pitch it to Dick as maybe something Wayne Enterprises could fund. What do you think? I think that would be perfect. Get your nom on. From nom on to Tim Drake. If you live in Gotham City, leaving your house is dangerous. Let's just admit it. Why risk having your car totaled by monsters in the grocery store parking lot when you can have your food delivered right to your door? <coughs> That's where Namon comes in. Using our app, you can totally choose your preferred grocery store, fill your cart with the items you want, and have them delivered in one of our armored delivery vehicles. We guarantee your food safe arrival or your money back. Don't stress, just get your Namon. From Tweak Gaming to Tim Drake, your gifted subscription to at Tomology is about to expire. Hi, we wanted to let you know that your gifted subscription to Atomology is about to expire. If you want to tweak gaming instead of Twitch. <laughs> Excuse me. I didn't mean to bump my mic. Welcome to Tweak Gaming. Atomology uh, and keep enjoying their custom channel emotes. Be sure to renew in the next 72 hours. I love it. Uh, regarding Mothman of Point Pleasant. To Tim from Connor. I don't know if this idea stems from a lack of sleep being overworked or what, but I want to say, Tim, as your friend, I love it. <clears throat> Why couldn't the Mothman be real? You're fighting a secret society of people that call themselves owls. Who knows what the truth is? Depending on the timing, I'm so ready to go cryptid hunting with you. Let me know when you're thinking. When you're thinking. So imagine we found something. That would be so cool. GNN, your news headlines. <clears throat> to Tim Drake from GNN. Hi, Tim. Here's what's happening in Gotham City today based on your subscription preferences. New gloves could reinvent VR experience. Op-ed. Arm the GCPD. Okay. Uh, thanks to new innovations in Silicon Valley, the next uh, VR gold rush could be right around the corner true touch gloves from a startup of the name of the same name promises to reinvent how we interact with digital worlds read more op-ed arm the gcpd someone has to say it the gcpd needs to be need to be armed i know what you're thinking they already carry guns no in a city full of uh, full of the kind of maniacs and scumbags Gotham is home too. GCPD needs to fight fire with fire. Their evidence lockup is overflowing with confiscated supervillain weapons. GCPD should be allowed to put them to use. Damn. No. That's a horrible idea. Runaway AI shut down at Harvard. Students and faculty at Harvard University are scratching their heads after the award-winning H21 AI created last year uh, began mm, programming its own AI in a programming language currently indecipherable by experts. Alan S. Lewis, head of the program, says the implications are concerning. Understatements? <laughs> in the world of DC Comics, that's horrifying. Terrifying. Oh, God. All right. All right, we already did Babs. Red Hood. 
Red, 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 red hood. It's first. All right. Grabbing a target may inflict fear in nearby enemies. <coughs> Damn it. Uh, gear. Nah. Okay. And then to emails. From Niall Neil Niall O'Hara Real Estate. Looking for a home? Jason, leaving in living in Gotham City has always had its pros and cons, but I can comfortably say there's never been a better time to be a homeowner in our fair city. Did you know that Gotham Academy recently posted a new all-time great averages uh what a time to raise kids there are also numerous vacancies in some of the hottest neighborhoods in gotham city leading to prices we haven't seen in five years it's because batman's been missing don't just live in a house live in a home let me award-winning real estate agent person name ohara find the right place to help you plant roots call today to set up a consolation appointment From Isabel Ardila to Jason Todd. I'm glad you're enjoying the book, though I'm sorry you found I it found you at such a tough time. I know what it's like to feel lonely, even when surrounded by people. But when I uh so even when surrounded by people, when I don't have anyone to talk to, I like to write things down. I keep a journal with me for stuff like that. But you could you could just do it in the notepad on your phone or on your computer or whatever too, as long as you're not keeping it to yourself. I should be back in Gotham in about six weeks, which I know probably sounds a world away. But once I get back, we should hang out. Maybe we can make your uh, make your it may. Oh, my God. Maybe you can make me your chili. I was thinking about that last batch you made for days afterwards. News headlines. Hi, Jason. Here's what's happening in Gotham. Wonder Woman to publish tell all auto bio. <laughs> Damn. Wonder Woman making the headlines should be no surprise by, uh, to most by now, but the real head scratcher in today's news is that she has announced the writing of an autobiography. 
in the press release issued earlier today. She says that she hopes the book will. Op-ed, Batman is the real villain. Okay, J. Jonah Jameson, go the fuck away. Someone has to say it. Batman is Gotham City's real villain. The gun, the guy who runs around with no regard for the law, absolutely pummeling people who don't behave in a way he approves of. Beating up supervillains is a slippery slope that we as a people cannot. Okay, J. Jonah Jameson, go the fuck away. Gotham Academy celebrates rising grades. Faculty at Gotham Academy, at Academy God, have cause for celebration today as a third-party investigation into student performances has found a median increase of roughly 12% across all grades compared to three years ago. That's kind of cool. All right. Just to be sure, I did actually like equip him with shit, right? Right, okay. All right, just to be sure, let's quickly check some things. Uh, 541. 541, 593, makes sense, she's the one who just went out, uh, and Jason's is 541, yep, yeah, okay, so it's Jason's turn. Alright, so, any other interactions here? No? Okay. Alright, so before we head out to the, to begin the next patrol, I'm gonna run to the bathroom. I'll be back, don't go anywhere. So first things first, I'm thinking, okay, so case files, that's what I'm looking for. We did the Mr. Freeze, we did a couple Mr. Freeze ones. Um, we could do Clayface or we could do Quinn. I'm thinking we'll do Clayface, um, and we'll do that as Jason. I'm hesitant to go in for uh, Harley Quinn at the Monarch Theater because I kind of want to send in Nightwing for that one, or Tim. But uh, yeah, let's go after Clayface. Clayface's next move. Uh, hold on, let me make sure I've got everything good here. All right. Play face. Study the clay recovered from the muggings at the mugging sites, but clearly clay uh, it's clearly clay face, but the DNA is different somehow broken. Though the clay seems to, to stabilize when it comes together. That means clay face will become stronger, strong, stronger as he reassembles himself. Uh, we have to find him before he fully reconstitutes. Tim set up the back computer to scan the city for unusually dense concentrations of clay. Excuse me. But it will take a while to pinpoint Clayface's unique chemical signature. In the meantime, it's impossible to know where Clayface is. Mr. Freeze. Dr. Theodore or Upshot? Uh, we don't know what this, what it is. Uh, we've read that. Mr. Freeze forced the scientists. You build him a powerful machine of some kind. To free, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Oops, wrong button. This is the one I want. Case files. Clayface. Launch. Going to the docks. Muggings and hanging out at the docks. Clayface is really slumming it. What's his plan? 
Hard to say. Mr. Carlo has always been rather unpredictable. Dag it. I guess I'll have to go check up on him. Be careful. We still don't know for sure what the turbine might have done to him. So, if I remember correctly, Daggett is the one who is responsible for Clayface's creation. At least if I'm remembering correctly from the animated series. From Batman the Animated Series. That may not be fully uh, accurate to the comics. I don't know for sure. But it I don't think it's a coincidence that, the, that my brain connects Daggett to Clayface and we're at the Dixon docks, you know? Oh, no, no, no. No, Jason, there you go. Buddy. Fine. This is where the stolen gear from Elliot Studios ended up. Lights for Elliot Studios. Guess they were too big to steal. This is just junk. <laughs> Why would someone steal it? Excuse me. Yep, yeah, Clayface has been through here. Daggett. Of course it takes me to Daggett. Where can a man-sized lump of clay be hiding? There's a clay mimic. I did follow the trail. It led me here. Trick, but it won't work on me. Belfry, I see some clay. He's moving fast. Stay on him. Oh, I got this.
throttle. Looks like he's going underground. Maybe he's going to the sewers. But why? Are they the only ones? Looks like it. Okay. Okay. Ah. I'd say he took some liberties. Clayface's movie script. The script is covered in mud, but an excerpt is still visible. Interior Reservoir Knight are awesome. Hero Clayface and the evil Batman are fighting. Clayface is losing, but laughs in the face of danger. You can kill me, Batman, but you'll never kill my legacy. Everyone loves me, but they hate you, the terror of Gotham. Batman, that's why you must die. Clayface, without you here, they will finally love me. Batman laughs dementedly. He puts his foot on Clayface and pushes him into the turbine. Clayface disappears into the darkness while Batman keeps laughing. Yeah, some liberties. Just a few. I didn't put any mods on, Jason. <coughs> um, so first off, mods. All right. Uh, home.
Actually, I think I'm going to do this one. More health. Um, then melee mods. Oh, they can't. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, there we go. I knew I was forgetting something, but I couldn't remember what it was for the life of me. Well, that's not good. Play Batman. I should have killed you a long time ago, Basil. I will make the same mistake again. You're just making things up now. Your sorry ass fell into the turbine by accident. Batman was there to rescue your hostages, not kill you. How would you know? You weren't. I saw the security tapes. You didn't have shit to do with it. If Batman wants me to change the script, tell him to come down here himself. Let him come. He can't. He's dead, Clayface. But he was in the reservoir. Just a few days ago. Oh man. You really don't know. It's been almost a year. Damn. Wow, I picked right, man. God damn it, mouse. You can give up whenever you like. How could you?
I suggest you merge together, Clayface. You might remember oh, shit. Great. More goddamn clay. Belfry, Clayface got away. I'm coming back. <laughs> Crash a film set and anger the director. That was the achievement I just got. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, that was great. That was good. I put some new info on the board. Play homunculus, play amalgamate. I keep doing that. No mods for the suits, but I can mod that. Uh, yeah, all right. Something else, huh? Yeah. You want to talk about it? Nope. Sure. <laughs> well, 
You know my doors. Uh. Cool. Cool. Good talk. <laughs> I love them. I love them so much. Pow! Energy drinks. You are not ready for the next level in taste. Hey, maggot, are you still? I'm, I don't know why I'm giving this a surfer boy act, a, a surfer voice or a stoner voice. <clears throat> but hey, maggot, are you still drinking baby energy drinks when you could be taking it to the next level? Kapow energy drinks have twice the caffeine of other leading brands and flavor so powerful your unborn children will taste it. Try banana blaze. Oh, God. Okay, I'm done. Ugh. Good deck from Jason. From Henrietta Tingley. Hello, Richard, and thank you for your kind email. I'm flattered you have so many fond memories of the Tingley Bakery. If only more people in the neighborhood felt the way you do, we might still be in business. I'm more than happy to share the snickerdoodle recipe with you. Please make sure it goes to good use. I appreciate the offer of payment, but instead just send me some pictures when you make your first batch. Oh. One co uh, if anybody wants to make them, there they are. Um, mix it together. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. From Dick, just hunted this down for Babs. Say no more on it. <laughs> All right, what's the next, uh... We might be able to find some correlation between Talon and other cryptids. Do you think people confuse the Talon for something else? Maybe the Chupacabra was the Talon. <laughs> no, the Chupacabra is the Chupacabra, for sure. But the Ozark Howler? What about Bigfoot? Dick, please, this is serious. Clayface alive, but where is he exactly? This is what Bas a Basil Carlo looks like. Uh, let let's swap over to Nightwing and send him to uh, after uh, to the Harley Quinn one. Um, Dionysium, Orchard Hotel. Yeah. All right. Oh God, my nose. Uh, the failsafe device we found in Doctor Upshot's office is something else. Whatever Freeze built must be super powerful. Upshot's disruptor may be our only hope to stop it. Level 23 to 26, we're not quite there yet. Well, 10 to 13 for Gotham on ice. Ah, uh, tempting. Uh, what's hers at? 10 to 13? Okay. Yeah, we'll do her. Then in Nightwing. Okay, Nightwing's at 542. Robin's at 542 as well. Barbara's at 594. Jason will go out on, will be the one who goes out on, um, on, uh, patrol, so. Oh, damn it. Keep doing that. All right. X. Lower power, higher health. Or higher power, lower health. Um. 
Go with the health. Okay. Email. Oh, from Corey! Corey, as in Coriander, as in Starfire. I know we had plans for this weekend, but I'll understand if you would rather cancel with everything going on. Another option could be that I come to Gotham. The Titans are willing to help if you'd let us. You don't have to do this alone, and I know you well enough to know you benefit from being around friends. Let us be there for you. I expect you'll say no, but I told Cyber a Cyborg I'd at least try. P.S. If dinner is still on, I promise not to talk about work. Aww. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Dr. Upshaw tried to do the right thing in the end. It's good to know at least one of them still had a conscience. We still don't know what kind of machine this failsafe is supposed to stop. But it's powerful enough that even Dr. Upshot was afraid of it. We'll put the disruptor to good use. Hopefully before Freeze puts whatever plan he has into motion. Oh, I was going to check what's night what's 587. Okay, so yeah. Yeah, we'll send uh Nightwing out to uh track down Dr. Q at the Monarch Theater. I used to be someone I didn't want to be. But now, I'm free. You can be too. Guys, come check this out. Dick, it's upside down. I got it. <laughs> it would have flipped, rotated, well, unless he turned it off. Why is she selling healing bracelets? Supplements? Damn. What the hell's a free glow egg? You don't want to know. You don't want to know. I found out, and I'm telling you right now, you don't want to know. She knows this stuff doesn't work. So what's her angle? Most Gothamites will see her be involved in one or more violent crimes a month. You know, statistically speaking. What's that got to do with anything? She's selling them hope. Oh, crap. Come to the Monarch Theater tonight. I've got an explosive announcement just for you. Pixtograph. literally. Pixtograph. Totally. I love their names for social media. We've got... Fuck, what was it? Uh, Pixograph, we've got... Um... Not Twitch, it was Tweak. Tweak Gaming. Um, man, I love it. Well, Batman would have hated that. You getting this, Belfry? Indeed, sir. It seems Dr. Quinzel has made a spectacle of the event. Shocker. Whatever Harley has waiting for us in there isn't going to be pretty. <laughs> Who's faster than a speeding bullet now? Now give me a second to refresh myself on what he can do. Oh, he has a new thing. Um Yeah, sure. But um let's see what do we got here. Three darts at once instead of just one. Strike enemies from further away. Okay. Chain okay. 
And then knocks down all enemies. Right, okay. Wait. Cancel mission. I just had a better idea than Nightwing. I'm gonna send Robin because he wants to because he has a mission to defeat uh the freaks. The freak bulldozers. I put some new info on the board. Yeah. Yeah, so we're gonna send Robin in. Plus also stealth. And that's whole Robin's whole thing. It's a custom made electromagnetic field generator. Once it's activated, every cryogenic device within range gets fried. It's very impressive. I hope I get to see it in action. Hopefully it won't come to that. I mean... Alright. Alright, anyway, we were... We were, yeah, I said it, we were going here. But yeah, Nightwing say Bruce would have hated that about the Harley Quinn signal. Alright, we are going to skip that again. We are, yeah, I said it, we are. Co-opting the bat signal. There are lines you just don't cross. Belfry, are you seeing this? Indeed, sir. It seems Dr. Quinzel has made a spectacle of the event. Spectacle's an understatement. This feels like a circus. Oh, I love that. Now, hold up. I think. Did I have an invisibility thing for him? Four pitch shot, microbots, bow spin. Evade decoy. Apparently, I don't have invisibility for him. Large enemies, that's what I'm looking for. Go to sleep, my friend. Belfry, the freaks have the theater on lockdown. Any ideas? There might be an old entrance, I remember. Doubtful the freaks know of it. A secret back door to give adoring fans the slip? 
Bold actors never tell trade secrets, sir. Okay, hold on a second. Not that. No sound. Special takedown. Harder to spot. I just sworn I saw something about him being invisible. Um. guess not all right so how do i hold for okay 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 ah there it is cloak i thought i did see something but i don't have it unlocked yet okay this sure looks like a secret entrance robin yet again eludes the paparazzi <laughs> Robin yet again eludes the paparazzi. Okay. His cape almost got caught in the door. Did you see that? Lol. Bruh, so much for stealth. Love to see Alfred on stage sometime. I bet he's good. My dear Cecilia, I have a small amount of certainty that you aren't traditionally someone who is usually as involved with productions. I must admit to being thankful to having you around. Your presence at rehearsals has been immensely soothing. I look forward to a new season, and perhaps even a chance to get to know you better. A. Pennyworth, Lawrence. My friend Sally. Oh, look at him. Letter to Gotham Heritage Society. Letter describing the funding issues the monarch faced following a fire incident. <coughs> City's really let this place slide. I mean, Batman the Musical. The Batman Musical. I wonder who played Robin. 
Oh, can I remember the name? This, I mean, not the name, the song. Uh, Superstitious Cowardly Lot. God, I wish you Ah. A superstitious cowardly lot. They plan and plot and always get caught. Their evil deeds all come to naught. A superstitious cowardly lot. God, I, that just blasted me back to Batman Beyond. Holy shit. All right. Over here. Sidekick? Whatever. I mean, I'm the thing that knocks the knife. That ain't the line. I'm the bell that sucks the fun out of Gotham. That's what you sound like. No, oh, come on, man. That's not cool. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. What is for decoy? Okay, and the bow staff, and then the dog. Me. Now that that's done, time to explore. Superstitious cowardly lot. They plan and plot, but they never, but they always get caught. All their evil deeds all come to naught. What's this? Belfry. Daggett Labs Weren't there again. Reports of a robbery from Daggett Labs recently. There was a break in the other night. Looks like it was Harley. Daggett specializes in medicine, stuff that Harley would love to get her hands on. I don't see any explosives, but whatever the freak stole from Daggett, there's a lot of it. Let us know if you find anything. Sorry, I'm looking for the lyrics to the song from Batman Beyond.
a superstitious cowardly lot. They plan and plot, but they always get caught. Their evil schemes all come to naught. A superstitious cowardly lot. A superstitious cowardly lot. Fun, fun fact: Not only did Ke uh, Kevin Conroy voice Bruce, old man Bruce Wayne, in that series, but in that specific episode where he, uh, where they were at that Batman musical for Bruce Wayne's birthday, Kevin Conroy was the voice of the musical Batman, and he was the one who sang a superstitious cowardly lot. Rest in peace, Kevin Conroy. You were the absolute goat. Old script. The queer community faced abuse and discrimination in, in the 1950s. But in the theater, queerness was an open secret. They famed Southern, the famed Southern Gothic playwright, known only as Snagglepuss, adopted his pseudonym to explore characters and subject matters considered taboo by wider society his work put him in the sights of the house un of the house un-american activities committee but they were never able to so much as uncover his identity i wonder if maybe that was alfred a heart is a kennel of thieves 50s maybe could have been alfred A superstitious cowardly lot. They scheme and flee, but they always. Do 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 do. Welcoming. I wonder if these symbols are always Robin or if they're Nightwing. Like if if I if they changed it, I bet they do change to e whichever hero is coming through. I need to know. I need to know. I need to know. I need to know. Let me Google this real quick. Uh, what's the name of this mission? This is the Harley Quinn Doctor Q at Monarch Theater. Do 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 do. Superstitious cowardly lot. Too far. I found a video walk and it's Robin again. Uh let's see here. Uh let's see here, let's see here, let's see here. Let's see what is Nightwing. Or whomever. Come on. Right, this video is doing it as Batgirl. Oh, I'm so back. Yep. It changes to whomever we're going. So Batgirl's there. Uh, so in the video, it's Batgirl symbol. I bet if it's Red Hood, it'd be Red Hood symbol and uh, Nightwing, Nightwing symbol. That's clever. I love that the that the developers did that. I I really appreciate clever devs like that. That's really clever, and I really ha I really love it. Come on, there you go. Superstitious healthy lot. They plan and plot, but they always get caught. Their evil schemes will come to naught. Like brought more than a few friends. 
superstitious cowardly lot. Close enough. Okay, I can't do it apparently. Yeah, no, I can't do it for because probably because I'm indoors. All right, man, turn around. Can't go up over that. All right, my only way in is right here. Come on, turn around, bruh. Don't see me, 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 don't see me. Looks like we got company, freaks. Keep your eyes out. I need to see what that was. Oh, fuck me. Okay, fine. You think you're dumb? Uh, 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 oh. That's a superstitious cowardly lot. Fan promotional poster going all the way back to the late 1970s. Gotham City had a punk scene. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Mucus membrane. Oh, come on. All the Robin stamps. Jeez. I love that she knew exactly which one was going to be coming to, you know? Zatara, hey! The grandson of legendary stage magician Luigi Zatara, Giovanni Zatara, has ma had magic in his very blood. His act was renowned for its spectacle, and he toured widely throughout the 1980s. One of his earliest known performances was at Gotham City's Monarch Theater, during which a trick malfunctioned and accidentally started a fire. Miraculously, the fire was out before the first responders arrived, leading to a rumor that Zatara possessed real magic abilities, which he does, because his uh, daughter has them too. Learn from him. Get off the geometry, Robin. Come on. Oh, I could have gone in that way. Damn it. Okay, fine. All right. So this is the way we're going. Is this the way we're going? No, it's not the way we're going. That's right, we're following the sticker, the, 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 not stickers, the stamps, the paint. Nobody needs this many mannequins. <laughs> Way too many mannequins, says Robin. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Ooh, how do I get down there? Ooh, yes, please. Do 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 do.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something tells me there's only bad things behind that door. Dr. Q, you have in you. A wink. Oh, look. A hero coming to stop me from helping you. What do we say? Don't worry. That's why I made this. Give you the courage to do what you always wanted to do. An implant that lets you take on the world! This is too much. Do you really believe that Harley Quinn wants to help you? I bet you want to see it in action! Does the data tell us what Harley's implant actually does? They don't seem to be implanted with anything. Good to know. Of she does. Why don't we try this again? <laughs> More freaks? Seriously? Is this how you make fun? This ain't what I signed up for. for Harley's magic cure-all. <laughs> it helped us get you where you need to be. Isn't that right, Quinners?
Belfry, I think Harley has bombs. Execute Echo Protocol. Belfry, can you disarm these bombs remotely? They appear to be on a closed circuit, sir. You'll have to disarm them manually. Come on! Disarm the damn thing! Don't worry, it ain't all bad. 
I got one last little surprise for you. Wait, I got an F in sidekicking? I really don't know how to take that. <laughs> I really don't know how to take that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. There's new information on the board. Yes, there is indeed. All right. Stop thing. All right, Ooh, email to Barbara from from uh, uh, from Tim. Okay. Tim Drake, I have made it. Okay, <clears throat> maybe this is a dumb idea, but maybe we could do movie night or something. I'm sure one of I'm sure one of us has enough space in their living room to fit everyone right this is such a great idea tim i think it would do us all a world of good to hang out somewhere other than the belfry talking about something other than work what did you have in mind might i suggest a walter cooper picture quite remarkable that he could achieve given what he could achieve given the technology of his day many consider him to be the masters of noir i have the entire box set of the swift and serious fast and the furious <laughs> Just putting that out there. No pressure. I have it, though, if we want. I would rather be eaten alive by Clayface than watch one of those films, Dick. We should watch a good movie like To Live and Die in Del Rio. Aw. Tim, I have made a huge mistake. <laughs> Ten underrated Basil Carlo, uh, Carlo rolls. Have you ever allowed yourself to be defined by someone else rather than stand on your own two feet? You ever wish people could just see you for your individual contributions? Are you sick and tired of living in the shadow of someone who never truly appreciated you and constantly com compared you to others to eat away at your self-esteem until you would do anything for their approval because you weren't capable of giving it to yourself? Req can help you accomplish all that and more. Say goodbye to your inhibitions and say hello to the you that you wish you could be. Don't live your life, re -cue it. Oy vey. okay. Oh. 
Monarch Theater was first built as a theater in 1908. It was turned into a movie house in the 1920s when the Great Depression hit. Due to frequently low ticket sales, the Monarch Theater faced demolition on multiple occasions, but thanks to the effort of dedicated theater lovers, the building was branded a historical site and was saved from being torn down. The Wayne family financed its restoration and it became one of my parents' favorite destinations. It's also where they were killed. Patrolling near the Monarch Theater is always difficult, but it's a reminder of everything I fight for. I feel the same way whenever I go past my father's memorial. He's gone, but he inspires me every day, Barbara Gordon. Everyone on this team has known loss, but I'm glad we found each other. Oh, family. Anyway. Paging Dr. Q. No. Uh, we're going to call it there tonight. Um, oh, excuse me. Victor's hubris has always been his greatest downfall. Master Bruce was finally able to get him on the path of rehabilitation, but... With Bruce gone, he doesn't see the point. Unfortunately, yes. Let's talk to Alfred. Harley's building herself an army with those implants, but what does she want with an army? It would seem to me that it's Dr. Q who's causing all this chaos, no? Aren't they the same person? Which Not means necessarily. if we target Dr. Q's legitimate businesses, it hurts Harley just the same. Sounds like a sensible plan to me. All thanks to you, Alfred. Harley challenge is available. Okay. But yeah, we'll, uh... We were gonna go on patrol with night, uh, with Red Hood. That's what we were gonna do. That's right. I remember now. No, we're not going to do that tonight because it's 10 o'clock. Um, Oh yeah, right. Distracted. Sorry. Ooh, I like that. I like that look, but uh, no. Um, no, we're gonna go back to the, yeah. Anyway, oh, email. Do you have trouble saying what you're really feeling? Have you ever found yourself stuck Following the beat of someone else's drum, ever want to just let loose and not worry about the consequences? Re-Q can help you accomplish all of that and more. Say goodbye to your inhibitions and say hello to that w you wish to be. You could be. She I bet she's email. Hold on, I have to check. I have to check now. I bet she's emailing each of them a uh, personalized version. <coughs> Uh, 
How many mealy mouth little know it all ex boyfriends have you left unpunched? Uh huh. She has absolutely tailored these to each of them. Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> Oh, man. All right, all right, all right. Back to Jason, back to Jason, back to Jason. Because I'm calling it a night. It's after 10. Okay. Anything else? No? Okay. So, yeah. Before I get distracted again, thank you so much for joining me this week. Thank you so much for joining me tonight as we've continued our, process, our way through this game. A uh, reminder that next week uh, we will be starting... On Monday, we'll be starting a new game. On Tuesday, we'll be continuing. And Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday, we'll be continuing the same stuff. Um, but on Monday, we're starting a new game. Uh, I'll let you guys know if something comes up and changes things. Until then, um, you should absolutely check out these amazing people I've listed up here, which includes Yvonne B, who's currently streaming right back there. Um, you should absolutely check her out. It's uh, twitch.tv slash Yvonne B, as you can see right up there right where i'm pointing <coughs> um <coughs> excuse me uh i have even more recommendations in that link tree right down here and speaking of that link tree you should absolutely check it out because that link tree has links to my socials where you can follow me for updates my discord um my patreon my throne wish list and a bunch of other stuff that you should absolutely check out uh speaking of that patreon i mentioned it at the top of the stream that i have one you should absolutely check it out because it helps keep me able to do stuff like this and improve my channel and so on and so forth uh so yeah that would be how you do how you help me out if you really want to um but anyway uh yeah that's it for me for the night that's it for me for the week even um so yeah we'll be back next we'll be back on monday and until then remember to have empathy be kind be safe love yourselves and love everyone around you and i will see you all next time i love you all sorry checking okay yeah i love you all peace out